Good afternoon, everybody. Drama is a very powerful and potentially a very empowering medium. Role-playing enables us to express ourselves and to articulate concerns that we would otherwise be inhibited about. So this AXA Outlook project uses a form of participatory drama called Forum Theatre to explore the roots of vulnerability and the sources of resilience in coastal communities and to understand how poor people um, are affected by these interlocking risks. So floods and extreme weather, economic uncertainties and poverty, as well as longer term climate change. And it builds on um, my research interests in resilience and particularly in individual, social, community resilience and what I call radical resilience, which supports positive transformation after um, extreme events. So I'm very lucky to work with a charity based in Kenya called Safe Kenya, and with their Mombasa-based Pwani group, who are shown here, I'll develop a drama which is actually based on the real-life experiences of poor communities. Forum Theatre actively involves the audience, and it invites the audience to take on roles in the drama and to identify the root causes of their problems and to jointly formulate new ways of overcoming and actually overturning those problems. And very often, this challenges conventional scientific assumptions and outsiders' views of these circumstances and of the risks that these communities face. This is um, a town called Porth Leven um, in Cornwall. It's just a few miles from where I live. And it's been quite badly hit by the storms this winter. Much of the fishing fleet was destroyed um, and there were major livelihood um, impacts and impacts on local businesses. But one week after the, the final and the biggest storm of the winter, which was called the St. Valentine's Day Massacre because it happened on the 14th of, of February, hundreds of people turned out to clear all the debris from the harbour. And this was this great demonstration of a kind of community resilience that my research focuses on. So a particularly innovative aspect um, of this project is how we're going to work across cultures to draw out the similarities, but also the key differences between the experiences of coastal communities on the one hand in Kenya, but then also in the UK. So we're going to bring the actors from Pwani in Kenya to Cornwall, and they'll undertake a series of workshops um, with communities here, and we'll make a film of the Kenyan drama and these Cornish workshops so that we can take these voices and these perceptions of risk, but also these different solutions that are proposed directly to science, policy, and corporate audiences. And we hope that this will kind of challenge and inform work. And in this way, that the project uh, will foster learning, not only across different geographical communities, but different scientific and professional communities. So I'm extremely grateful to the Scientific Committee and to the Research Fund for their support for this very exciting project and look forward to working with you uh, over the next two years or so. Thank you very much.